Hello, it is the 27th of September 2019 and spooky season continues with yet another scare event. This is Coastosaurus. Yes, welcome to Extreme Screen Park. It's the first year that we've visited here, so I've never been here before. Not really sure what to expect. We're heading over to our first maze now, and I'll let you know what I think of that when we come out. Right, well, we've just done our first maze, and that was Stilton Hall Hotel and Else Bar. That's really quite a long maze. Um, I actually quite enjoyed it. It wasn't particularly scary, um, but it was a lot of fun. There's a lot of really quite nice theming in there. Um, some very interesting characters. A lot of interesting characters around here as well. Hello! <laughs> yeah, not sure where we're heading next, but I'm sure we'll find out in a minute. Right, next maze is going to be Ash Hell Penitentiary. Now, I've heard some interesting things about this. I'm slightly worried. Let's see what uh, let's see what we think of this. So Ash Hell, yes, another long maze, and again, really well themed. Um, some great acting in there, and yeah, some interesting, very well, very interesting animatronics as well. Um, yeah, I got quite a lot of uh, jumps out of the animatronics, they were, they were quite good. Um, some very potent smell pods in there, as parts of that maze stank. Um, yeah, it, it's, it's certainly done really, really well. Overall, it was a really good maze and I really enjoyed it. Well, I've just had a bite to eat because I was absolutely starving and that was the messiest burger in the world, but actually very, very tasty. On the subject of food, we're now heading over to do the pie factory and see what this is about. Well, the pie factory was very good. That's my favourite maze of the night so far. Um, so, a really interesting use of space. Um, some uneven floors in there, animatronics. Actors popping out from where you really don't expect them to be popping out from. It's really very creepy, very disturbing. Um, it's the sort of maze that really gets me. And, um, yeah, that was excellent. I really enjoyed that today. Right, having calmed down a bit after Pie Factory, we're now heading over to the village. So, let's get in there and see what we make of it. <laughs> I 
the village was great. I enjoyed that a lot. Um, again, some really interesting use of character. Very creepy individuals in there. Um, some great jump scares. Um, and some cracky animatronics, including in the outdoor sections of that. that they work really, really well and get some really good scares off those. But again, great use of space. And it's so varied from start to finish. There's loads and loads of different bits as you make your way around the little village there. Um, all with their own sets of characters. It's, uh, yeah, that's really good. Right, okay, it's now time for the final maze of the night. Ruby, what's it called? Hodo Vodo. Booty booty. Oh god, Hoodoo Voodoo was fab. I really enjoyed that maze. It's just a lot of fun. Um, I am not a fan of hooded mazes and the first half of that was with a hood on and it's, it goes on for a very long time. There is, however, a lot more going on in that hooded section than you would normally expect to find in a hooded maze. Like They had a soggy floor that really took me by surprise, I really wasn't expecting that at all. By the time the bag's taken off, you then go into the rest of the maze and that was great fun. Um, there was a scene with some voodoo dolls where one of them actually was an actor who jumped out and terrified the life out of me. Um, and lots of other little scenes as you go around there. It's really nicely themed. Just, it's great fun. It's a fun maze. And so after doing Hoodoo Voodoo, that does bring to a close our night here at Extreme Screen Park. Um, We've had a great time here. There's some brilliant mazes, some very long mazes, um, some really good theming, some brilliant acting. My favourite maze of the night does have to be Pie Factory. That was really good. I got some serious scares out of that. Honourable mention to Hoodoo Voodoo, which was just so much fun. Really, really enjoyed that one. Both Ash Hell Penitentiary and Stilton Hall had some amazing theming throughout there, as did the village. Um, the village also was really, really good, really enjoyed that. And so, yeah, there you go. Um, I do recommend that you come down to Extreme Screen Park. It's a great night with some brilliant mazes, and it's well worth a trip over here. That is now all that we've got time for tonight. And so, until next time, bye-bye. I do hope that you enjoyed our video today. If you did, please do hit that subscribe button. And if you really want to find out when a video goes up, then hit the bell as well. For other stuff that we're up to, have a look on our social media pages and you can find the links to those down in the description. Again, thanks for watching and we'll speak to you next time. Bye bye.